Oh, what's going on everyone? In this video, I'm gonna explain the fastest ways that you guys can start farming for Haley's parts. Now this method is gonna differ depending on whether you guys, you guys have a really high level character or whether or not you don't. So let's get into each part. So unlocking Haley is actually a bit different than the other descendants because you won't have to go and get the blueprints or anything for it. Instead, they're already gonna be ready. But what you need to do is go and get the individual pieces in order to start crafting these. So it's a bit different but it takes away the process of going for amorphous materials. Now, most of her parts will have a chance of dropping at 25% from this brand new invasion mission. So if you're a high enough level and you have the proper build, I suggest running this mission in order to unlock Haley the fastest. So after completing this mission, these parts will all have a 25% drop chance and you're gonna have a chance at three of the different parts. Now this mission only takes about four or five minutes to complete with the proper build compared to some of the other missions, which can take over 15 minutes each time. Now, because Haley doesn't require amorphous materials, instead of just getting one of these pieces in order to craft her, you will have to get upwards of about 30 of them. Now, depending on how fast you complete this activity will depend on how many of these drop each time. So there are chances of actually getting additional each time you do it. But if you're not a super high level or you don't have those crazy builds built up already, then this could take longer resulting in you only getting one each time you complete the mission, but either way, it's still gonna be much faster than the other mission. So at the end of this, you can see it took me five minutes and this was nowhere near my fastest run, and I was able to get one of the parts to drop. Now, this is one of the parts you need 36 pieces to get, so you have a chance of getting one every couple of minutes that you do this mission. Now, you can get more than one each time you complete it if you're able to do it faster than the way I did it, which is very, very simple if you have better builds. Now, the only problem with this is that if you're not a super high level, you will have to go and get this part from other missions. So if you bring open the acquisition info, it'll tell you that you can get these parts from mission monsters as well. Now I went into these missions to test out how long this would take to see if maybe you could just get, go into the mission and the enemies would be early on enough that you could just back out and farm it like you would with some of the other parts. However, this part only drops at the very, very end of these missions. So it can take up to 10 minutes to get this done each time you wanna get just one of these pieces and you will need over 30 of them in order to craft her. If you're not a high enough level to do the invasions, this is the route you're gonna go in order to get these parts. You just go into those missions and you would farm those missions in order to get the parts, but the, the parts only drop from the final boss at the end of the mission. So I went into this shelter and saw, so, to see if I could uh, scale up the difficulty and get these parts to drop or to see if maybe you would get more than one each time you complete it. But unfortunately, I only got one at the end of getting one of these, which makes the invasion missions much faster if you have the proper build. So another great thing about running the invasion mission over this is that not only are you gonna get the chance at all four parts, meaning you don't have to continuously rotate around missions, but you'll also get a ton of gold. So luckily it is actually pretty cut and dry how you can unlock Haley for free. The one method is if you've been playing for a while, you literally just have to run the Oisuary invasion and you just run that a bunch of times. Unfortunately, you will have to run it probably around like a hundred times, but luckily it only takes about two to five minutes each time. But if you don't have a high enough build, what you'll have to do is you go into the acquisition menu. And you just go into each individual part and we'll tell you exactly which mission it drops in, but it will only drop from that mission monster. So if you're not a high enough level to do invasion, you have to go in here and do the mission that it, where it says that it drops in a mission monster. So from there, you would just simply click on that and then go run the mission that's associated with that monster. But that takes much longer. That's why instead you just simply want to run the invasion mission. Now, once you've run the invasion mission about 10 or 15 times and you have a decent stack of these parts to build Haley, you may want to go back and just run the missions associated with the parts with the mission monster because it'll guarantee that you get that one part instead of the invasion mission, which has a 25% chance. So you're going to have a chance of getting one of the four. So that's going to be the fastest way to unlock Haley for free. Hopefully, this does explain things so that you guys can get started farming her. I genuinely think that you can get this done in less than a day, if you, at least if you go the route where you run invasion. Otherwise, it could take a bit longer. I hope you enjoyed this, and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.